Hello friends, this is Ishwa here and in this video let us see the review of iOS 12 that will be tested on the iPhone 5s. So before getting started let me give you a cool intro. So here's the size of this Dalva Beta 6 update, it is about 356 megabytes and before updating my available storage was 4.95 GB and this is the version number if you want and after installing iOS 12 Dalva Beta 6, here's the available storage which is 5.34 GB which is a, a lot of free space which is good. After updating to iOS 12, I feel a lot of improvement, a lot of performance improvement, like uh, the app opening time just a lot more, lot more faster, we can see the fastness after installing this update. So after opening the control center, I can feel the smoothness and let me just uh, surf through this OS and give you a good time lapse. So as you saw that was very smooth and uh, I could really feel the fastness after updating to iOS 12 Dalek Vita 6. Some of the games like Subway Surfers also run pretty much uh, faster than the previous update and I feel it is getting better uh, with updates on the iPhone 5s and it's a good uh, work by Apple's developer team. I had a bug in uh, iOS 12 developer beta 4 that whenever uh, uh, I open some social media apps it just said that the screen time is over as uh, I didn't even enable the screen time but it uh, did show that screen time is over and whenever I needed to overcome that I need to turn on the screen time again and then I need to disable it but after this update it has been fixed and it is a great thing and here are some of the new splash screens which I went through in iOS 12 developer beta 6 here's the photos one which is giving some of the info and here's the welcome to the app store splash screen here's the apple music splash screen now after all these let us check the geekbench scores I didn't uh, take the results of iOS 12 developer beta 5 as it wasn't that great so I just took the uh, Geekbench results of iOS 12 developer beta 4 over here which is 1053 and 2012 and let us check the Geekbench scores of this one and uh, I will compare it with the older one so run benchmark and in the meantime I think Apple is doing a very good job in providing updates for the iPhone 5s till now it's been about five years since the release of iPhone 5s and they are still providing updates for iPhone 5s uh, and we also get the get almost the same features as uh, the newer iPhones so it is a great thing which we are getting from Apple and after updating to develop a beta assets I think the screen status is no more there and uh, whenever I need to open the control center there is no more lag in it and also the notification center is much more smoother so here i am with the uh, geekbench results of ios 12 developer beta 6 and the single core score is 1081 and the multi core score is 2156 so when we compare this with ios 12 developer beta 4 um, here is it 1053 2012 1081 2156 so as you can see it is uh, improvement and if you see all of these results you would see that it is always increasing like 954, 917, 957, 1053, 1081 and the multi-core score is 1034, 1096 and 1947, 2012, 2156 so it's been an increase in the graph in the scores of multi-core score 
as well as the single core score so i am very happy with that so i hope you enjoyed this video if you like this video hit the like button and if you want to share this video to your friends hit the share button so thank you for watching have a great day peace